there are lots of ways of um, dealing with that, starting with very, very simple methods. So Laplace correction is probably the simplest example. Um, so in Laplace correction, uh, what you do is you count how many times each event occurs in your observation, and then you add a 1 to all counts. Okay. So if, uh, if the green word didn't occur at all in the bucket, you would assign it a count of 0 plus 1. Right. And if something occurred once, you would assign it a count of two. So uh, it's, a, uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a popular method in early statistics. It does have a big problem uh, be when you're dealing with text, and that's because our event space, our set of possible outcomes, uh, is extremely large. Right? If you're dealing with a vocabulary of you know, 10, 10 million words, then what you're doing is you're adding... 10 million non-existent counts to every document. That is going to skew the distributions very, very uh, heavily. In fact, absurdly heavily. It's going to swamp the real counts. Um, so it's quite crude. Um, uh, a variant of that is to replace a 1 with an epsilon. And that's a reasonable thing to do, right? So uh, what you would do in this case, if I had a bucket that had uh, a blue, a red, and a yellow, uh, and my total vocabulary was uh, blue, uh, red, yellow, and then green and uh, gray, what I do is I add an epsilon to each count, and uh, then I increase an overall uh, size of the document by uh, 5 epsilon. So this way the probabilities still um, add up to 1. So uh, now I would have a small but non-zero probability for green and for uh, gray. <laughs> Uh, there is uh, there's a variant uh, of that uh, called discounting, and in discounting what you do is, so in, um, in correction methods uh, you take a positive constant and you add it to all counts. In discounting you take a constant, you subtract it from all the non-zero counts. So I would subtract an epsilon from these ones, and then I would spread out the remaining mass, however, however many epsilons I got, over the zero uh, probabilities. It's a slightly different way uh, of doing the estimates. Uh, it's a, the math gets a little bit annoying on that, but but some but some people really like it.